People are still buzzing with excitement after this weekend's bombshell announcement that MetLife Stadium will host the 2026 World Cup Final. All right, Fox 5's Antoine Lewis has reaction for both New York and New Jersey about the fanfare and economic boost this is expected to bring to the area. I was ecstatic. I was happy. Was I? I wasn't surprised. It's the right venue. It's the right market. Mark de Grand Prix, president of the New York Red Bull Soccer Club, reacts to Sunday's announcement. The winner is New York, New Jersey. FIFA officials declaring right here on Fox 5 that MetLife Stadium will host the 2026 World Cup Final. July 19th, 2026 is the date the final match will be played in New Jersey, but the World Cup Tournament is a 39-day event that will feature 48 teams playing 104 matches. Matches will be held at 16 world-class venues in North America, including the U.S. cities of L.A., Atlanta, Boston, and Dallas. MetLife will host a total of eight games. And the display that our fans and our local community communities will bring to life for their national teams in this market will be phenomenal. Shortly after the announcement was made, New York City Mayor Eric Adams and New Jersey Governor Phil Murphy jointly released this celebratory video and both appeared on Good Day Monday to talk about the impact this will have for the region. And I know some people who are not soccer fans are saying, OK, what's the big deal? How about two billion dollars in economic uh, stimulus right here in our region? A million people coming into the area, coming to our restaurants, visiting our uh, Various sites. It is a huge, huge deal. Economic development, jobs created, passion, visit visitors, uh, the, the focus of the world. And local soccer enthusiasts hope that having the World Cup final here will help attract even more interest for a sport that many say continues to be overshadowed by other professional sports. We've seen it over the years. It keeps growing faster and faster. This will just be adding more fuel to the fire here and help us really raise not only the game of soccer, but Major League Soccer. So we're still two years away. And just to give you some numbers, the Super Bowl averages about 120 million viewers. The World Cup final averages somewhere between two and three billion sets of eyes. Reporting from MetLife Stadium, Antoine Lewis, Fox 5 News.